Telos has taken its first hit of the winter, over 20 inches in some areas. But the show must go on as Scott Dion navigates through the snow. This is the type of stand that pretty much every processor operator likes to see. There's nothing in here other than spruce. I should be able to get uh, 300 cords back here easy enough. Cutting 300 cords for the week should be easy for Scott. But finding the buried piles is where the real challenge lies for Stevie 1010 White. I won the snow, so uh, I'm going to have to deal with it. What did you think of the storm yesterday, Stevie? Giving you any extra headaches? I sure did. Uh, with that whiteness there, boy, it was hard to see my piles. Yeah, it takes a bit to get used to. First big storm. Yeah, we must have got 20 inches or better, didn't we? Oh, yeah, at least that. And the snow balding you much off the trees? Yeah, every time I grab a tree, all the snow that falls from the top comes right down on top of me. It's still kind of like being in the middle of the snowstorm out here today. One hazard replaces another. But overall, everyone is welcoming the transition to winter. I can finally smile. Hopefully, all the wet weather is behind us. Things should start turning around now. Conditions are going to get better for everybody all around. The, the guys hauling wood and for us in the woods cutting. The guys are definitely busy trying to keep the roads open. Yesterday, they plowed all day long. And last night, they've been going pretty much uh, around the clock with, with little breaks, making sure that the, the main roads are, are open so that Andrew can keep loading trucks and keep sending wood to the mill. From the woods crews to the truckers, everyone is pushing through the tough conditions. Deep in the frigid woods of Maine, these guys will stop at nothing to get the job done. All new American Loggers, Friday at 10, only on Discovery.